Amanda Nation. So I'm coming to you with another general message. Um, if you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome. Make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. So let's go ahead and get into it. So with this message, I was anticipating only one like subject card, but my guys had like some type of whole story here so definitely take what resonates what doesn't do not feel obligated to make it stick to your life a situation okay angel number 646 could be significant as well also 96 also i see that as 69 someone could be a cancer you have be cancer sun or moon or you can have it heavy somewhere in your chart okay so the first card we have is fallen hearts Okay, so um, this could have something to do with somebody being heartbroken behind something. Okay, um, uh, disappointed. Okay, uh, broken hearted. More, I'm feeling more like disappointed. Okay, that's how I'm, that's what I'm feeling, and and I, I'm also feeling like picking up like egotistical energy. Okay, as well. So. Um, also on the lighter side of this, I'm picking up, um, like someone being watched. Okay. Someone may, may, um, maybe being admired. Okay. As well. I'm picking up here. So the first, um, to further clarify this, we have gifts. Okay. So something significant about a gift. Um, we have souvenir promotion delight. All right. So like I said, I was picking up like a lighter side energy here. So something significant in reference to a gift. The number 36 could be significant. All right. You also could be seeing um, 3636 or 369. Okay. Or, you know, different variations of that number. Then we have overload. It says assessment, obligation, overwhelm. All right. So. Then we have vow and we also have mask. Okay, so with the overload and the vow, that is that alternate in energy that I said I was picking up. Okay, I feel like here somebody could have vowed to do something or took some type of vow. Okay, and now it's the feeling of disappointment, like the overload energy that I said I was picking up. And then we have mask. It says deception, pretending, inconsistency. Right beside this Fallen Hearts card and where this Mask card fell and the Overload and Vow is Breaking Bro Code in Reverse. So something significant here about, and I heard it's a dog barking, so that's confirmation. But, um, yes, yeah, something significant about, um, some type of Bro, bro Code being, uh, broken. Okay, we do have the Mask card, so someone could be, these individuals could, you know, they wear a mask. All right, um, then to further clarify the Fallen Hearts card, we have Shapely. Okay, so something significant about Shapely. All right, someone could love your, could love your shape or like your shape. We have Cult Base. So something significant about a Cult Base. This came out in a previous reading that I um, just did. Okay, something about PDF. All right, so something significant here about PDF, and the dog is still barking in my background, y'all. <laughs> Someone can have a dog or dogs. Um, something could be significant about multiple dogs, okay, or a group of dogs, all right? Something could be significant about a fraternity as well, I'm picking up. But we have PDF, we have Ben, all right, so something could be significant about um, some type of PDF document or something in a bin. I'm also picking up a trash bin on a computer, okay? We have SIM card, so something could be significant about a SIM card, okay, on this computer, in this computer, in this phone, okay? Um, we have slippery, so something significant about something being slippery, okay? I am picking up like a, 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 I am picking up like some type of video, Okay, I am picking that up. All right. So to further clarify this, um, breaking the bro code card as well, uh, we have completion. So I feel like some type of cycle has um, come to an end. Okay, collective. And then we have bananas. All right, in reverse. So I feel like, like I said, it's different energies or um, 
feelings, emotions that I'm picking up here, okay? And like I said, I'm feeling more of like egotistical, um, upset, disappointed, that type of situation, okay? Excuse my son in the, in the background, but um, he was he's sleeping. So then we have someone you miss, okay? So something could be significant about someone. Um, this did come out in reverse, so this could be a reference to somebody you don't miss, okay? Something could be significant about bananas when it comes to this person, okay? Something could have been bananas when it comes to this individual, okay? Which hence the, the completion, okay? And then we have knives. Something significant about knives here, okay? And we have mop. All right, so we have knives and mop. Something about knives and a mop, okay? When it comes to this break and bro code energy. And then we have worry, okay? So like I said, I was picking up that that we have the overload um car here. Like I said, I'm picking up a lot of different emotions, okay? So next we have Grandma Dearest, okay? So the Grandma Dearest car came out in reverse. Um the break and bro code car came out in reverse. So this is something that is known or in in current energy. Okay, so with the Grandma Dearest card that came out in reverse child somebody somebody grandma is pissed okay that's the energy i initially picked up off of this card okay um some somebody is is i don't know this could be multiple grandmothers when it comes to this whatever this uh group energy is over here okay um because the family card did did come out in reverse too so with this family card coming out in reverse this is giving me like disowning somebody Okay, or disowning a couple people. All right. Um, to further clarify that we have consent. All right. So something significant about when it comes to consenting something. Okay. We have frigid. All right. So something about someone being cold. All right. Something could be significant about someone being um you know, a transitioned energy. That's what I'm picking up too with the frigid card. All right. Then we have iron. All right. So someone grandmother could have loved using an iron or believed in using, you know, an iron and ironing board. Okay. Something could be significant about a hotel too. I was picking it up as well. All right. Then we have paintbrush in reverse. So that paintbrush energy is giving me this mask. That's the um, energy I'm picking up off of this right now is the mask energy. Okay, but it did come out in reverse. So that's telling me, you know, someone, basically someone trying to paint a picture and then it flopping, basically. You know, trying to keep up a facade and it flopping. Next, we have handsome. All right, so something significant about someone being handsome. Okay, someone's grandmother. Um could be coming through and letting you know you're handsome someone's grandma could could have been you know could have like i'm seeing somebody like pinch somebody's cheek you know and call them handsome or you know rub them across the their head you know and or their hair and call them handsome or you know something about someone's eyes as well okay next we have hanger all right so something could be significant about a hanger okay something could be significant about a closet okay then we have chubby all right so someone could have remembered um and so i'm getting with the iron and the hanger like i said i was picking up someone's grandmother who believed in ironing okay the ironing board even if she you know put clothes down on to put the towel down and put the clothing on top of that and you know just all of that ironing goodness you know what i'm saying so um i'm saying that and then someone's um grandparent or grandmother could have remembered them as being chubby someone could have been chubby you know what i'm saying when they were younger okay you still could be chubby now nothing wrong with that okay but then we have death fights in reverse i was picking this up in the previous reading as well so something significant about death fights okay this could have taken place like with this family card i'm picking that up too like something with this family something with this um this bro energy this click energy okay so next we have he's out to get you okay i do feel like too that this is a message from a grandmother energy okay so it's it the card came out in reverse all right so this could be a part of whoever this he is could be a part of this bro click energy okay 
So we have imagination and we have stress. So I feel like something this something is heavier weighing on somebody's mind. Something is on someone's mind. Okay, here. Like I said, I was picking up a lot of different emotions here. Okay. So we have crying in reverse. So this is something that is known. Okay. Something or someone is this is incurring energy. Okay. So something significant about someone crying. Um, then we have laundry basket and we have basket again. So that gives me, that's still giving me, um, something could be significant about someone's laundry basket, someone's laundry, something could be hidden in a laundry basket or a type of basket. Okay. I am seeing a um, basket, like the baskets, near, I'm seeing a basket near a front door. Or something like that okay so something significant about a basket near front door is a short basket with like handles so something significant about that okay and then we have elastic all right so something significant about elastic someone could have like one of those um laundry baskets that have like the straps on the sides the um the ones that you can fold down and fold back up okay i'm seeing that too all right so something significant about an sd card Okay, something, a SD card could be like pocketed in something elastic. I'm getting that. Um, something could be significant about a shallow grave as well. Okay. Oh, confirmation. Just belch. Okay. Something about a light bulb. Okay. Some, something could be significant about someone busting out somebody's light bulb. All right. Or um, like a lit area. Like near a shadow, shallow, uh, shallow grave, okay? Something could be significant about a shadow as well, okay? Or shadow people, okay? So then we have, I am somebody's child in reverse, okay? So um, with this coming out in reverse, I just feel like the energy I'm picking up off of this is someone feeling as if, you know, not belonging, okay? That's what I'm feeling, like someone not belonging or feeling as if they don't belong, okay? So... Um, we have scissors, all right? So something could be significant about scissors. Something could be significant about a document concerning a child. Um, and scissors, okay, something could have been cut up, okay, or destroyed or something like that. Something could be hidden, all right? Then we have what attracts them to you, okay? So the energy that I was picking up off of this was not good energy, okay? So some someone could view you as a child, Okay, and that's what attracts them to you. Okay, so that's what I was picking up off of this. Okay, I got to get a message. Then we have crickets in reverse. So I did pick up this energy in a previous reading. And it basically, and I'm picking up the same thing here. But um, I'm just basically feeling like somebody having to eat, eat their words. Okay, or some someone being silent. Or someone wanting someone to be silent or some shit like that. Okay. Then we have calendar. All right, so something significant about a calendar, okay, or a sp specific month, specific date, day of the week, okay. Then we have large, deep pit, and this is in reverse. So something significant about a large, deep pit, okay. Something could concern a child being in a large, deep pit or a shallow grave or something like that. Okay, then we have short. So that's giving more of that energy that I'm picking up. Um, I'm definitely picking up a child energy off of that. Okay, off of the large deep pit energy. Okay, and with the card. Okay, and then we have lodge. All right, so this lodge card is like the my meeting card. Okay, like my occult, my secret society. You know what I'm saying? Meeting card. Okay, so something could be significant about. Um, someone having a meeting in reference to a child, okay, um, someone just meeting at a lodge, okay, discussing something, all right, so next we have fate, all right, and it says coincidence, fate, fatalism, fortune telling, all right, so something significant about someone getting readings, okay, um, someone's fate, Okay, someone trying to uh, find out someone's fate, someone's destiny. Okay, um, something could be significant about who someone is is associated with or linked to. Okay, someone's um, parent or father or grandmother or grandfather or something like that. Okay, I'm picking that up. All right. 
Um, the number 10, which talks about completion as well, is on this card. So you could be seeing 10, 10 as well. All right. So then we have robbery. All right. It says exploitation, um, incaution, and unfairness. All right. So something could be significant about someone trying to um, set up some type of robbery or um, something significant about a robber. Okay, the number 13 is also on this card, okay, which is talk, which talks about um, death. Okay, so something could be significant about, and we know death is about new beginning, well, endings and new beginnings, all right? So something could be significant about an ending when it concerns a robber, the fate of a robber, okay? So then we have our Truth Teller Oracle. So with the Truth Teller Oracle, we have tell everything you know, we got you. This is an ancestor message, okay? We have she's plotting a water sign, um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, okay? Something could be significant about a stolen home. We do have the robbery car here as well, okay? Something could be significant about a stolen gift as well. Then we have or someone's attempting or trying to steal a gift. Um, I'm picking up both energies though, but we have gang stalking gone wrong. So something could be significant about this male group and gang stalking. Okay. Next we have, she's not guilty of fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. So something could be significant about a fire sign who isn't guilty. Okay. Then we have going through an intense transformation. We have, you're their karma. We have hates women. All right. We have a group of women who sleep with one another. Okay. We have she was behind it. This came out in reverse. So a water sign was behind uh, the situation here. We have paid for black magic. So this individual paid for black magic. We have disgusted and can't be trusted. We have demonic possessed children. This did come out in reverse. We have she paid for surgery to look like you, all right? So whomever this is that paid for surgery to look like you does have demonic possessed children, okay? Now, times out of 10 is because this individual was playing in spare work. Um, we have it's not about the children. They want to control you. We have mother figure doing black magic, okay? This mother figure could be a water sign. We have corrupted politicians, okay? And we have family murder and family. Sadly. All right. So then we have the investigation oracle. They wanted me to pull this out per usual when I do these readings. So the first card we have, y'all, is... Hold on. All right. So we got something about disorderly conduct. All right. So something could be significant about disorderly conduct. All right. Whether it's at work or school. Um, we have 1,490 to 1,623 square feet, okay? That could be the size of a lodge. We have underage prostitution. So whatever this is, um, underage prostitution takes place in whatever, whatever this is. We have search team. We have a garage, okay? We have a shipwreck. So something significant. I keep picking up that shipwreck energy, y'all. And I did just post a message on my community tab. Um, we have she is guilty of water signs. So double quadruple confirmation <laughs> about these water signs. There's a couple of them. Um, we have airborne disease. So something about an airborne disease, y'all. We know how they go. We have 1,941 to 1,946 square feet. Okay, and then we have condos. I keep on getting a message about some condos. All right. So that could be the size of these condos. We have MK Ultra. That message keeps coming out. Um, we have a wooded area and we have a school. So something significant about a wooded area um, around a school or near a school. Okay, these condos could be around a wooded area as well. We have you calling, we come, baby. This is an ancestor message. Something significant about a drowning, and this is in present energy, okay? Something about starvation as well, and then a fall guy, okay? 
we have aliens okay so something significant about an alien or aliens i have been picking up on this energy okay and we have a teacher or professor so i know this may sound crazy but some type of professor or teacher may be an alien <laughs> okay y'all remember um damn what is the name the faculty thank you spirit so that's what i'm picking up we have family full of purse. Okay. We have white supremacy. All right. So family. Hold on. Did that? Okay. No, that didn't. But um, something significant about white supremacy. Okay. This could be surrounding some type of court situation too. Okay. Or um, yeah. So here we go. Right behind that, and my nose is itching. Cold case. All right, I did see, um, I did share with the um, Breonna Taylor situation today. So something could be significant about white supremacy and a case or a cold case, okay? And it's not just one. Then we have hotel management, okay? So this could have taken place at a hotel um, because we got hotel management and we got hotel security. So something could, damn, y'all. This investigation oracle, I'll be channeling so much. All right, y'all, I'm back. I had to give me give me some drink. Um, but anywho, so we have cold case. We have white supremacy. We have cold case. But then we have hotel management and hotel security. So something could be significant about um hotel security and hotel management when it comes to this cold case. All right, we have um airport security and we have cover up. So something about air, airport security covering something up, okay? They could be a part of this white supremacy situation. Then we have 1,164 to 1,490 square feet, okay? So this could be the, um, the size of, I've just heard like a bathroom or something, or the size of an area near... Um, that hotel security may be in, airport security may be in, okay, some type of uh, room or some shit like that, okay. We have missing females, so after that, so this um cover up could involve a missing female. Then we have 1822 to 1848 square feet. Then we have a submarine, all right, so something significant about a submarine. And then this square footage, okay? Next, we have alleged, okay? We have logistics, all right? We have 1,910 to 1,913 square feet, all right? We have Senate. So something about that space and Senate, okay? Um, we have whistleblower and we have police chase. So something significant about... A whistleblower maybe being in a police chase, all right, or someone being behind a whistleblower. Um, we do have one bedroom apartment or something significant about something being behind a one bedroom apartment. Okay, a police chase could have taken place behind a one bedroom apartment. Okay. Um, then we have fatality. All right, so something significant about this missing woman and a fatality. All right. Confirmation 711. Okay. Um, then we have house fire. I keep picking that up. We have laundry room. So something significant about a laundry room in a house. Make sure you're cleaning out your dryers. Then we have gun residue and we have sheriff's office. Conspiracy. So something significant about gun residue, a sheriff's office, and some type of conspiracy. Something could have taken place involving a sheriff's office. Okay, so something could be significant about gun residue in a sheriff's office and um, this being labeled like some type of conspiracy theory, okay, or some type of cover-up or something like that. Next, we have test and we have X. All right, so some uh, X could have went through some type of test or some or an X could have been tested um, for something or whatever. My nose is itching. 2008 to 2012. Okay, so something significant about that. Then we have Smithsonian and we have pageant. I was picking pageant came out in a channel message earlier. 
okay so something significant about smithsonian and then we and like i said we got pageant in reverse this missing female could have been a part of a pageant okay um but then we have don't drink intoxicate don't don't drive intoxicated somebody in a pageant could have been driving intoxicated or someone could have been harmed due to a drunk driver okay then we have 2049 to 2060 square feet okay we have governor in reverse so something significant about a governor this could be the size of a home or property or office building or something like that and we have trash compactor many organizations involved so something significant about a trash compactor and and or and an organization okay this governor could be a part of this organization or whatever all right like i said before some people could be burning cutting trying to trash shred evidence then we have pulled over and we have hospice okay something could be in reference to uh Hmm. A pageant, per, a pageant individual could be in hospice. A governor could be in hospice. Okay. I don't know why I'm picking up. I am picking up accident energy off of this pulled over. Okay. Someone responsible for an accident could have been pulled over. Okay. We have police involved and we have lieutenants. So someone, a police lieutenant could have been involved with someone being put in hospice. Okay. We have flower shop and cave trapped. So something significant about um, someone being trapped in a cave. I have been picking this up. Okay, we have ship in reverse. So some a ship could be uh, trapped in some type of underwater cave, or someone could be trapped in an underwater cave. Okay, a submarine or or a ship could be could get something trapped. I'm picking up Titanic energy. Okay. So that is everything I have for y'all. I hope you enjoyed this message. If you did, definitely thumbs up this video and I'll talk to you in the next one.